Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Anna. My channel name is Only My Dreams. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so we're gonna start off with a very quick review. All right, now I did purchase these on my last Dollar Tree haul. I will put them up there in the eye in the sky so you guys can go check it out. And it, my other previous ones as well, I put them up there so you guys go check them out. And this is the PS Clean Beauty. Um, I did try this hair mask, but I did it a little differently because it tells you you gotta have your hair wet. And, you know, so I sprayed it down. I got it wet. I left it on for about, I want to say 20, 25 minutes. Then um, I washed my hair. I did it kind of like backwards. And it was nice. Uh, it's not a deep conditioning mask. It's, but it was nice. It was just okay. It wasn't anything from another world. My hair felt nice. It was just okay. Me, I usually need something a little bit more deep conditioning. As you can tell, I have a lot of natural curls, as you can see. And it's dry. So normally I have to put oils and all kinds of things in them because it's just my natural, it's the type of hair texture I have in the curl. And I did brush it a little bit. That's why it's frizzy. So normally I need something with this a little bit more intense. Now I did try the shampoo and the conditioner. I have those upstairs. This is the other one um, that I still had down here. But I did try the shampoo and the conditioner. And what happened with the shampoo was it left my hair squeaky clean. So it's a great shampoo to get rid of buildup. If you have if you use a lot of hair product, you put in a lot of like, you know, creams, you flat iron it, you put in on your sprays, you know, there's a lot of, you know, there's a lot of buildup that can occur. That left my hair squeaky clean, not to the point that it was stripped, but it was squeaky clean. So that's going to be a great product to use once a week just to get rid of the buildup. The conditioner worked well. It wasn't a deep conditioner, but it conditioned my hair. I have, like I said, my hair texture is a little different. I need a little bit more than the average bear. Um, so would I buy it again? No, I would just use it, enjoy it, and just keep it moving and continue to use my products that have a little bit more deep conditioning. Just a quick review. There you go. All right. Now, my store still had, I want to give you guys a heads up. They still had these available because I went out today. So they still had the Kinder um, Main Street Taco Bowl. They still have this available. They still had the Fajita Recipe Bowl with the Mexican rice. They still had this one. Okay. In the store, they had this. these still available was the one next to Aldi's. Okay. And then they still had this one, the, um, the Maine's Italian Meatball. Okay, so these were still available locally, just to give you a heads up. So I want you to know if you're looking for them. Now, the store that still had some of the nat natural heaven products that are keto and pe paleo, you know, friendly. They go for a lot more than $1.25. Um, both stores, the one next to Rainbow had, I think the mash still available and a couple of boxes of the rice and the other store had one, one particular one. I can't remember what it was, but you know, I didn't see any more of the brown rice. I think a lot of people picked up that brown rice, but I did see the mash and the white rice, I believe, because I know I definitely saw the mash, the creamy mash. So they're still available locally. Good sign, right? Okay. So let's go ahead and do some foods. I also have foods in the freezer. I'm not too sure if I'm going to share those, but I want to share what I do have for foods. It's really important to get our pantries fully stocked up right now with everything that's going on. I found some name brand Swanson Natural Goodness Chicken Broth, 33% less sodium, non-GMO, no MSG added, 100% natural, the best by date is February 24 of 2024, 2024, and it's the less sodium. They also had the regular. Um, if you prefer the regular versus the less sodium, I, I always have to bring in less sodium whenever I can because of my hubby. Um, so there you have it. I got four of these. I believe I got four. Did I get four? For my pantry because the dates were really good. Yeah, I got four. I'm going to put these in my bag over here and get them off the table. Woo, I got a bag over here, you guys. <laughs> I got to facilitate. I got to facilitate. Then they had the beef broth by Swanson. Again, no MSG added, gluten-free, 100% natural. 
And the best buy date for this one is June of June 2 of 2024. June of 2024. Excellent date. I got two because they did not have a reduced sodium. So I, I only got two. But it's a great way to have some beef broth. We don't use beef broth that often, but it's a great way to have it on the shelf. So when you do need it, it's there. And it's canned. And it's good, honey. It's good. Let me fix my bag. My stuff is starting to fall out. <laughs> the struggle is real. Now, I did also pick up for food. I'm missing an item or two here. Uh, three more of the Eat Regal Jasmine Rice. They did also have the long grain rice. They had the red Spanish rice. I prefer the jasmine rice. And you can't beat it for 90 second microwave. 90 seconds. Boom. It's ready for $1.25. You can't touch anything for a quickie for rice for $1.25 anywhere. You can't. So I picked up three more. There you go. Then they had something that was new. Uh, they had the Power Aid. Mountain Berry Blast and Fruit Punch. These go into the freezer. They're freezer bars, so they're considered sports bars. Okay. And you get 10 one ounces. Um, it says advanced electrolyte system helps replenish four electrolytes lost in sweat. Formulated with B vitamins. So you get 10 one ounce um, freezer pops, freezer bars, as they call them, freezer bars. And it's name brand, you guys crazy. So I did get two of these for my household. Now heads up, in the store next to the rainbow in my area, that store had the champion bras, those really soft, super soft bras and hot pink for little girls in a size large, like, you know, for maybe like a, maybe like for a young teenager but not somebody that's like fully blossomed out. Yeah, you know what I mean. They have them there and they go for, I think the price on it was like $30. They have them there and it's by Champion for a dollar. I didn't buy them because I don't need them. I couldn't, I, I wouldn't be able to use it. <laughs> I don't have nobody I could give it to. So they have it there available. Heads up if you have a little girl, you know, they have it there. Then um, towards my staples, they had a new pink salt. Available. So I decided to get this. This is um, by Salt Seasons. And I'm trying to see uh, Texas. I'm showing Texas. And um, Best Buy date 2032. Did You heard right. 2032. Because you know salt lasts a lifetime. As long as, long as it's in a cool dark place. And I think this is from Texas you guys. I think. It's not GMO, kosher, ISO, um, I think. So it's one pound. I believe it's one pound, right? Yeah, one pound. So they have that there now, and that's what it looks like. And I did get the other pink salt, um, you know, just so I can have it because we do use it. And they're great to make scrubs and all kinds of things, too. So pink salt is good for a lot of different things, including... Um, if you have like, you know, some issues with bugs outside, if you line the front of your door or your openings, what have you, with some salt outside, that helps to kill some bugs too. Just a heads up. I found that to be helpful. Um, I also, dun, 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 was able to get some of the kitchen fixings. Um, this is the tricolor tortilla strips. These are so good. I really like these in my soups. They're just so good. And I like them in my sandwiches too. But what I was really happy to have found was the kitchen fixings, wonton strips. Oh my gosh, they got the wonton strips. So if you want to make your own egg drop soup, you get your wonton strips right there. And you can use it with your egg drop soup that you can make right at home. So I did get one of the tortilla, two of the wonton, because I never, ever, ever, ever see the wonton. And I was just, you know, head over heels happy that they even had it. I was like, yes, what? I am all about this. Then, um, let me put this over here because I don't want these to get crushed. I got to be really careful. I can't put this in my bag or it will go crunch, crunch. I do have stuff to show you for like the home and everything. I just want to sh show you the food items that I think is really important for us to get things into the house, into our pantries, 
on a budget. Um, so for the fun stuff, my kids already got into it. They have this new yummy, yummy Milo, yam Milo. Okay, so they look like hearts. As you can tell, they got into it. As soon as I got home, they saw it. They broke into it. Boom. And they liked it. Yes, they did. So they, they ate some marshmallows already. They got into that one. Then I did find the Tampico hot fries. This is just uh, a good a good go-to if you just want to have a little snack. Throw it in a bowl. Let the kids eat it. This one has salsa picante. Um, 3.5 ounce. So I got that as a throw in a bowl. You can have some. Then they had the Augustino's mini snack bites, tomato and oregano. I don't, we've never tried this one. So I'm not too sure if this is going to like taste good or if I'm going to have to put it like in a salad maybe as a topper. I don't know, but I wanted to give it a go by Augustino. And it is a 2.2.82 2 um, ounce. Why was that so hard to say? I don't know. Then they had some high chews. I don't I don't see high chews there often. I just don't. So they had the high chews in this flavor. And high chews are good, honey. Um, this is the immensely fruity, intensely chewy candy. So it contains two flavors. That's green apple and mango. And then they also had grape and strawberry. Okay, and then it has like it's a it's like the flavors in the inside. You see that? Yeah. So I bought those two. I know. I was just going crazy with the food items. Then this is something that I use often here at home. I love it when they have it. This is name brand Kraft, $1.25. Everything I'm sharing is $1.25. We don't have the Plus Store. Um, so this is Hickory Smoke Barbecue Sauce. I know this is the, or, no, this is not the original. They have the original as well that's really good and i know case for karen go check out her channel case for karen um she likes the original i like all of them so I, I got the original the hickory and i got the sweet brown sugar these are fabulous fabulous to to have when you're making any kind of meals making sandwiches you i like to use it with my canned chicken it's just a quick quick eat and you make some sandwiches boom you're done you can even top it off inside a baked potato you you know you flavor it up with the, with the um, barbecue you do some baked potatoes you got some baked potatoes and you put it in there to you know hearty it up oh my gosh you guys mm. i know i haven't had nothing to eat today nothing i am like starving like marvin and i don't even know what time it is what time is it it's 1 50 it's almost two o'clock and i haven't eaten anything okay then i was able to find the dull two liter lemonade they did have some other drinks i didn't get them i got the dull lemonade and these are heavy then i got the dull strawberry lemonade for the kids to try out so i got those two right and there are the two liters the big ones but they also did have a few other drinks available in the two liters but to get it for a dollar 25 is awesome Okay, then along with that, I got these 28 ounce cups so, you know, they can try out their little drinks and not make so much of a mess. Then they had the 18 pack by Sobisk chocolate sandwich cream cookies. Now these, I don't know how they packed them up. I don't know how many come in a pouch, but it looks like this. Oh, it's an 18, it's an 18 pack. So I'm assuming maybe there's two cookies in a pack, maybe, maybe, I don't know. There you go. Let's find out. Is it one cookie? Uh, I don't, it feels like it might be one cookie. I don't know. Let me see. Let's open it up and find out. No, it's two little cookies. So you got two cookies by Sobisk and let's try one out because I'm hungry. Mm. 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 Okay. Are they an Oreo cookie? No. But why do I taste like coconut in this? I have like it's a it's tasting like it has coconut. 
Does this have coconut in it? Because I, this tastes so good, but I'm getting like a coconut taste. These taste really good, but they're not Oreos by any means, but they're different and I like them. I like them. They're different and I, they have, I, I swear, I, I'm trying to tell you, I think it's, I taste coconut. I don't know why. It's so weird. Okay, moving on. I found the Taviv Pure Celion Black Tea in Apple and Cranberry. Now, this is a very nice name brand to find for $1.25, and you get 20 tea bags. Now, I don't drink tea. My husband does. My kids do occasionally. But with these, what I like to do, I'm just being completely honest, I like to put some in a pot, and then I'll throw some apples in there, and cinnamon sticks and oranges and I'll just stew and simmer and let and let it smell up the house the bottom part of the house what I also do is I put it I put these inside of a big um, um, uh, ball jar and I keep my leftover peels from the mandarins and from bananas and from apples and then I put two or three tea bags inside a really big container like this of the uh, of the ball jars, the really big glass ones. I fill it up with water, put the tea bags. I put all that in there, shake it up for two or three days, and I take it out and I give it to my plants. And all the oxyoxidants, oxyoxidants. I can't even say it. Okay, antioxidants. <laughs> and all that good stuff that they like from this, the apples, the core, you know, all that stuff. Is really good for them and it perks the flowers up. I know. Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. All right. Now for the kids, what I got for the kids is only two things. Yeah, you can have one. Um, I only got them two things. So they have the Play Doh in this big pack. Love these Play Doh big packs because each little container is covered in plastic. So it was not going to dry up. Love that. Then they had the Kitty Doh War set. So they have the little tiny set with the little thing that helps make shapes and what have you. So that's what I got for my kiddos today. My littles, I should say. Then I do have more. I'm telling you, this is a big haul. I'm going to show you all the housewares, the new glasses that I found and everything. So I'm, I'm getting to it, honey. Then um, I'm getting ready for what? <laughs> for the winter. The kids are going to start school soon. And then the bug can hit them. The last time we got the bug, because we got the, they had diarrhea, they had vomiting, we all felt ill, the whole house got it. And I would have paid anything to have these puppy pads. And these are the extra large, you get two in a pack to have these on the floor. Because when they couldn't make it, when I was laid out on the bed, they were laid out. It was, I mean, it was crazy. These come in really handy when kids get sick. Just laying them out on the floor. You have their little trash bucket that they can try to throw, in, throw up into. And if they don't make it, you're still okay. So it's great to have these for those times. Just saying. I did pick up a couple of more of their armor. No bean chilies. They did have these still at my store. The one, did they have them at both? I think they might have had them at both. But the one I got it from was the one from Rainbow. Next to Rainbow. And the best by date is 2024, so I did pick up a couple of more for armor, chili, no beans. This is a great one to have. All right. I picked up some Dawn because I like the Dawn. I like the Dawn. Then let's look into this bag here. As I continue to dig through the bags. I needed some new... Um, back scrubbers and I got three from my back so I got the blue one really nice one I got my black with the gray and I got the wooden one they had for April bath they still had this wooden one but you know it's shorter do you see how much shorter it is I prefer to use these but my husband has a better reach I don't so he'll probably use that one so there you go so I got these because I needed them then I found the bath steamers by Raves, Body Raves. This one is green eucalyptus scented. I bought these for little Frank. 
He loves a good bath steamer. I don't know if these are any good. We're going to find out. But this one, again, is the eucalyptus green eucalyptus scented and then this one is an orange blossom scented so they had these two options so that's for little frank when he takes a shower so he could do the bath steamers because he really enjoys those then um i got this for my um husband and it's a clean logic invigorating mesh mesh um body mesh sponge it has is infused with charcoal so they have these available. They also by Clean Logic had the orange ones, like you know, orange, teal, and another color. I just got the charcoal infused for the hubster to use. Then along with that, uh oh, why did this one come off? They had some more of the Freeman Cosmic Metallic Peel Off Mask. So I got another one that's a full size. And then this one, Little Frankie liked it a lot. The Pore Cleansing Volcanic Ash Peel-Off Gel Mask. He really liked that one. So I got him another one. This one's for me. Then um, I got a face mask. And it's the Freeman Rose Gold Sheet Mask by Freeman. Rose Gold Sheet Mask. So I picked this up. I know the light is going crazy on my phone. I don't know you guys I don't know then in the home department um, the glass department they had these glasses and these are not um, Dollar Tree they're by E pure can you guys see that E pure and my daughter loves the color pink so I got her these two pink glasses so she can use so they're like a solid pink and they kind of like uh, if you see it in person it's more vibrant versus what you're seeing here on the screen so and they're glass Heard that? The glass. So those are for her. Then let me get this bag. Okay. Case for Karen. Share these in her last haul or second to last haul from the Dollar Tree. I was like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got to find these. Found them. They had these next to the store um, next to Aldi's. Okay, so they have the initial and I found my initial and I thought it was so cool that they have the letter there on top so you can find it a little bit easier. It does have the little metal piece right here, the little leaf, and then it has a really cute bow. Love. Okay. Absolutely love. I was like, yes. Then um, I found this one with the A that looks like a little jar and it has the metal here and then it has the cute little bow. Love that. I thought it was just, I was all over it. They did have this in orange as well, but I wanted the white. I was like, oh my gosh, the white one. Oh, I live. Okay. So I got that one. Then from the Halloween department, I picked up this one. And I like this one because I had found this. <laughs> I found the globe. So a lot of y'all were showing the globe. I will tell you your future. So do you see that? Perfect. So I got the globe. I got this. And they also had, before I forget, they also had the little initial with that. So you can put this on a door dom, a door jam or something. It just looks really pretty. Love that. Then let me show you what else I found. That's in my bag. Okay. So they have the wood slices. And I bought one because I figured I could do something with it for my dollhouse miniatures. So I was like, let me get that. I did only get one book. This is called Bethlehem, a novel by Karen Kelly. Bethlehem by Karen Kelly. And it goes for $26.99. Okay. It sounded interesting, so I went on ahead and picked it up. I thought it might be a good read. Then I was really excited to see that they had the butterflies back. The butterfly die cuts. So they had this one. And it's a 32 count. They had the green. 
and they had this really pretty pink. So they got all three of them back again. Super happy about that. Then they had something different. These are switch plate covers, okay? My hair is like, I know I've been out and it's so hot outside. My hair is like, oosh. It has its own zip code today. It's okay though. So this is called Versatile Arrange As You Like Switch Plate Cover Decor. So they have this one with these beautiful whales and turtles. And they come like that as well. Do you see? So it comes with a triple switch cover. Comes with a single. And then you have your individual, if you just want to individually put them or even use them on another project. You don't have to put these on a switch plate. You don't. You can use them any way that you want. But I thought these were so charming. And then they had this one with the bunnies. So stinking cute. And it has a little grass and everything. And that's what the switch plate covers themselves look like. Then the last one I thought would be cute for the boys' room. But a part of it says, hello, baby. So I would just cover that little hello, baby part up. But it has um, the bears. And then the moons and all these little cute things. And that's what it looks like for the switch cover part. Okay, so they have those available. Then they have these really cool adhesive glitter wraps. And they have a whole bunch. I mean, I'm talking about a whole bunch of these. And I fell in love. So I got these three. They had more and they had more colors. These are just the ones that I was like, okay, okay. I can definitely rock those. And I can make... Put these on my notebooks because they're adhesive. You just take the, paper, the tape off and you can put them on top of your notebooks. Like if you have a notebook that you're using to see better days and you don't want to give it up because it has recipes, all kinds of stuff in there, you can glam them up. So it has this beautiful blue glitter, this gold glitter that I picked up. Like I said, they had other colors and then this one that looks like a mermaid. And they had two different variations of this one. This is just the color that I picked. Girl, who are you telling? I know. Well, believe it or not, I'm not going to show you this stuff in a freezer. <laughs> maybe I'll do that another day if it's still around. Because um, I already ate some of the pizzas. I got some chimneys and I got some the pizza bites. So I got four of the pizzas, four of the chimneys and, um, and the chicken, and then two, two things for the pizza bites. And that's it. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.